Hello everybody and welcome to part 2 of the Burning Shepherds box. I quite literally didn't even bother cutting, I just went from one to the other and... I apologise. I'm really excited to open these. We've still got another 18 packs to go. Um, I do love these booster boxes, I always will. And it's my first one I've ever opened. So we're gonna go through the second half, the right side, oh, starting off... Oh my... Wow, they're tight in there, aren't they? Starting off with Tapu Fini, my back. Ah, um, I need to change my position, I think. Because um, I feel like the second half, well, the second half might be better because we did pull three Ultra Rares, technically, but the Hollows were still cool. Um, where's... Oh, well, that was a really difficult pack to open. Let's just hope there's nothing of high regard or value in here. Um... Hang on a second, I think I might have to cut briefly. Um, we have a Darkness Energy, a Lunatone, an Olivia, a Curlia, an Oddish, a Duskull, so this pack is like messed up, a Moralol, a Caterpie, a Merrill, a Reverse Palisand, which is a Reverse Rare, and a Heracross Regular Rare. I do like the Heracross card, actually. I think it's surprisingly cool. Let's hit another Guzma, hopefully. Let's get a third one. Maybe a fourth. I'd like four, just for a playset. Although I kind of want three regular arts and one full art, to be completely honest. But pulling a full art Guzma in real life would probably be the coolest pull to possibly have. I cannot open this pack to save my life. This is... This one pack is going to torment me forever. It's like the neglected. Oh wow. Whoever made this pack definitely made sure that it wasn't going to be opened easily. Oh my god, I can't even open a Pokemon pack. What's my life come to? Um. What the hell? This is really, really tight for no apparent reason. I just hope something good's in here. I'm gonna have to do it off camera because of the fact my arms are being stretched out like hell. You know what? I might have to emergency get a pair of scissors <laughs> to cut this out. Just because it's so awkward. No, I think I got it. I think the contents of the pack are now out. Oh wow, that was an embarrassingly long time to open a Pokemon pack. Um, one, two, three, four. God, this, this is tiring. Here we have a Fire Energy, a Buffalon, an Escape Rope, a Wick, an Inke, a Stuffle, a Crabrawler, a Moralol, a Sandy Gust, a Reverse Rare Beware, and our Rare is a Marshadow GX. Wow, that's one of my favorite GXs in this entire set. Really cool card to pull, actually. That's the first hit of the right side, which I think is like the third pack. Still pretty good. Let me just leave that up in the weird spine. Um, okay. Right, let's move on to the Marshadow next. Because we just pulled one, let's move on to the Marshadow pack out and hope that we pull another one. <laughs> I wouldn't mind two. Oh, I wouldn't. I'd rather a full art of him. If you could give me a full art, that'd be great. Typical of the hardest pack to open in the entire box had a GX in it. <laughs> um, oh god, the pack is disintegrating in my hands. We have one, two, three, four. Um, okay. Fairy Energy. I'm gonna go through the commons a little bit faster now. Rodom Dex, Pokefinder Mode, Seedra, Plumeria, all also uncommons, but. Alone Grimer, Riolu, Meowth. Nolol and Vulpix, Wimpod, Reverse Electabuzz, cool reverse, and a Butterfree regular rare, okay. Electabuzz is a cool Pokemon to have as a reverse, but, okay. Let's hit up the Ho-Oh pack and let's hopefully get a Ho-Oh GX from it. I want a Ho-Oh now. I want a Darkrai and a Ho-Oh, those are the two I'd like to pull. Arguably my two favorite Pokemon in the entire set. Darkrai is definitely my favorite. Gardevoir, Darkrai, 
and how were the three I wanted to pull. We've already pulled one of which. Um, one, two, three, four. We have a Lightning Energy, a Noctowl, a Simisage, an Electric, an Esper, a Nightbat, Stuffle, Mudbray, Tynamo, Reverse Ralts, and a Gardos Hollow. That's a really cool hollow, actually. I like the hollow quite a lot. Let me go into the Weird Binder again. Um, really cool hollow to pull, actually. Anyway, we have a Tapu Fini pack art now. Okay. Right. This has been a really good box, I'm not gonna lie, we've had some really great pulls from it. Okay, let's put that aside. One, two, three, four. Please let me pull a full art Gosma. <laughs> Grass Energy. Sophocles. Electabuzz. Super Scoop Up. Rhyhorn. Riolu. Cutie Fly. Tynamo. <laughs> Duskull. Dapping Duskull. Bruxish. Reverse. Which is a reverse rare. And a Skull of Beat regular rare. Um. How many do we have left? I can't, I'm, I'm not going to count them. Uh, Necrozma. This one's going to be a little bit shorter than this first half, because I decided to go through the commons faster. Let's pull a third Guzma here. I want a third Guzma. I want four. One, two, three, four. Just a regular art Guzma. I'll be fine with that. <laughs> we have a Water Energy, Simisea, Metapod, Dusclops, and there is officially no Guzma. Venipede, Horsey, Cutie Fly, Lady Bar, Reverse Pantsier, and a Dusk Noir Hollow. We've pulled quite a few hollows on this side. It's another really cool hollow. Another Sinnoh Pokemon. All the Sinnoh Pokemon as reverses, as hollows, are really cool. Dusk Noir and uh, Darkrai are actually two of my, some of my favorite Pokemon. Dusk Noir, Darkrai, and Regigigas are like three, my three favorite Pokemon from that region. Um, we have a Marshadow, so let's go ahead and open this Marshadow pack up and hope that it opens easier than the last one did. Which I believe the last Marshadow pack we opened was the one that- no, it was actually- it was not. Because the one- it came at- we came afterwards, didn't it? I realised I showed the colour of that code, so we know- we have no hit in this pack, but... We have a Psychic Energy, a Soul Rock, a Simipo, Bodybuilding Dumbbells, not even a Guzma. <laughs> Alone Ratata, Porygon, Pampo, Pantsage, Reverse Lunatone, and a Weavile regular rare. Weird Weavile actually, looks a bit like the uh, stuff that wouldn't normally be in the set. Right, let's readjust these. ho -Oh, next. Let's see what ho -Oh can get us. Probably nothing, wouldn't be surprised. We've gotten some really great pulls, so I can't complain too much. Okay. Well, that was... Well, that's great, isn't it? It just showed the colour of the code. <laughs> One, two, three, four. We have a Fighting Energy. A Wobbuffet. A Charmeleon. Porygon 2. An Esper. Pikachu. Nybat. Dupider. Tangela. A Reverse Ace Roller, that's worth a little bit. And a Slowking Regular. I love Slowking. It's another one of my favourite Pokemon. I think you can see what types of Pokemon I like. Either big evil people or big derpy people. Um, I want a Slowking plush. I hope that one of those exists. Actually, Gengar is another one of my favourite Pokemon. You can't see it, but above the Mewtwo tin, right at the top in the background, there is a 1999 Gengar plush. Um, oh, I just whacked my tripod. There's also a Dragonite plush, which I got from Comic-Con. Uh, one, two, three, four. We also have a Pokemon movie Poliwhirl plush to the left, and then a Snivy from the black and white promos at the far left. Metal Energy. Wick. Mount Lanakila. My hand is going weird. There's so many trainers in this pack. Wishful Baton. Tangela. Dupider. Inkei. Ralts. Crabrawler. Reverse Survivor and a Toxicroak Regular. There's Godivar in the background, didn't even notice that before. Oh, my 
bad. <laughs> okay, how many packs do we have left? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I'm pretty sure. Yes, we have nine. Okay, so we're halfway through this half. We've had one real hit. We've technically had three. We did get a Guzma, I'm pretty sure. No, we didn't. We haven't gotten a Guzma this side yet. Let's get a Guzma, please. Thank you. I would like Guzmas. Um, one, two, three, four. We have a Fairy Energy. It's a Viper. Gloom. It's a Roller. Meowth. Magikarp. Krogunk. Pikachu. Pansy. Reverse Wick with a little bit. And Malamar. Well, I, I really like the reverse trainers. I think they're, I think they're great. Um, I'd love a reverse Guzma. That's worth like nine pounds right now. Um, yeah, but this is before Guzma's probably gonna plummet in price at some point because everybody will have Guzma eventually. But for now, he is worth so much. There is the code card, which we'll put aside, obviously. We've done that every pack, why am I pointing it out this time? Okay, we have a Water Energy, an Electric, a Buffalon, an Escape Rope, a Sock, an Oddish, Charmander, Meryl, Pantsage, a Reverse Ledian, and a Noivern GX, wow! This is the, technically the second hit of this side. It's been a pretty slow side overall, but really nice GX to pull. Quite like, I really like my own. I think he has a lot of great disruption potential in decks. Although, maybe there's some better stuff. Either way, I think my is a great card to pull. I think he's cool. What have we got left, though? We have a oh, whole pack up. Come on. Now we've gotten one EX. G I was say EX. We've got one GX. Let's chain for a second. Um. Ideally, I'd like to pull at least something here out of these last few packs because there's quite a few left. Um, let's just hope we get something. Um, what was this? One, two, three, four. I'm forgetting the pack trick as I'm going along. Um, we have a Darkness Energy, a Heat Maw, a Tormenting Spray, a Lana, a Caterpie, a Meryl, a Rhyhorn. Sandy Guest, a Hoot Hoot, I'm going through the comments incredibly fast now, a Reverse Rare Rhyperia, and a Rare Ledian. Okay, so the other, the Ledian was a Reverse Rare. We've, we've gotten multiple packs, we've had a Reverse Rare and a GX, weirdly. We've only gotten one full art so far. I kind of wish we got a second full art, well I mean technically we got the full art trainer, but Kumari is probably the worst full art trainer to pull. By the way, still a full art trainer, like, I can't complain. One, two, three, four. We have a Lightning Energy, a Dusclops, a Noctowl, a Simisage, a Riolu, a Cutie Fly, a Dupaidu, a Dogodomaru, a Wimpod, a Reverse Metapod, and a Tangrowth Regular Rare. That is the, that is the Sinnoh Pokemon that I don't like. Don't really dislike Tangrowth for some reason. Probably because he's strange. Um, what, there is five packs left. Okay. So what, what are the last pack arts? Is there one of each? Yes, there is one of each to end it off. So let's hope that Necrozma can get something here. As the last, second to last Necrozma pack. No, just second, yeah, second to last Necrozma pack. What can this... What's this gonna... Oh, this is another one of the awkward packs. Usually that's a sign that when I can't open a pack, there's something decent in it. Um, okay. Either way, we've had some... We had quite a few GX hits and, ho and hollow hits. And we even had a full art trainer. The only thing we haven't had is a... Oh, I whacked the tripod full on the... The only thing that we haven't had is a secret rare, which I've never pulled again. A psychic energy, a Rubombi, a Potown, weakness policy, 
Mudbury, Alolan Ratata, a Panpo, a Caterpie, a Porygon, a Reverse Electric, and a Mudsdale regular rare. But your Reverse Electric's pretty cool. I think that's a Reverse Rare. No, it's not. There's, diff there's two different Electrics in the set, one of which is a Reverse Rare. Okay, so last Marshadow. Let's recap at the end, but hopefully we'll get one more GX pull from the last four packs. I'd like a GX pull. Either a GX full art trainer or a secret rare. <laughs> Probably not going to be a secret rare though. There is a fire energy, Paragon 2. Oh god, these cards are falling. So much bulk. Simacy, Metapod, Mudbray, Tynamo, Oddish, Dapping Duskull, Donna White 7, Moralol, Reverse Cutie Fly, which is a reverse rare. No, it's not. <laughs> I'm thinking of Rebombi. I mix those two up all the time. Anyway, so last ho -Oh pack out. Really want something decent to from ho -Oh. ho -Oh. We haven't pulled a ho -Oh today. Hopefully. Just hopefully we get one. <laughs> Here. I'd love a ho -Oh from a ho -Oh pack. I think that would be cool. We have a Grass Energy. A Kiawe. An Olivia. A Kulia, a Sneasel, an Alolan Vulpix, Horsey, Nightbat, Alolan Grimer, Reverse Rare Electivire, which is cool, and a Hollow Kingdra. It's a really cool Hollow again. All the Hollows in this set are actually really cool. I do really like them. Um, let me just sleeve up the Kingdra. We did get a Hollow from the last four packs anyway. So, the last Tabufini pack out. Tabufini's given us. Arguably the most GXs of every single card here. Or maybe it has. I haven't been keeping track necessarily. That is a card. Why am I putting the card in with the codes? <laughs> we have a Fighting Energy. A Sorola. A Charmeleon. A Wimpod. A Togedomaru. Krogunk. Pansir. Magikarp. Reverse Ladybug and a Salazzle GX. Yeah, we did get a lot. we did get another GX. I thought we would. It's a really cool GX as well. Maybe not very playable, but it's still a really cool one to pull. I really like that card actually. Nivin and Salazzle are both cards which aren't necessarily playable, but they're still really cool. Like they're great to pull because they're just interesting cards. Last pack of my first ever booster box, we have a Necrozma. So I'm, I'd imagine that my bulk will probably go in this box because I have way too much of it. Um, we could still get one more hit from this. One, two, three, four. Let's do the last box. Last pack slowly. Fairy energy. Cedro. Lunatone. Rhydon. Panpo. Pansage. Esper. My bad. Stuffle, Reverse Soul Rock, and a Butterfree regular row. Hey, that was a really good box, I'm not gonna lie. I thought we had some great pulls. We started off the box with a God of War GX, one of the most expensive cards in the entire set. Followed it up two packs later with a Machamp Full Art GX. Later on, I don't know how many packs later it was. Yeah, we did get quite a few hits actually. We got a... My first ever Full Art Trainer, a Plumeria Full Art. We also got a Vile Plume, Hollow. I realized I gotta put these two down. Um, we got a Marshadow GX from the second half, a Darkrai, no, actually, Marshadow was in the first half. Darkrai Hollow, a Dusknoir, and a Gyarados Hollow. This binder is really weird. Um, and then we ended it off. The right side did have more pulls. We had a Noivern GX, a Kingdra Hollow and a Solazzle GX, and that knocked over the bulk. <laughs> anyway, thanks everybody for watching. I really appreciate you what, sitting, what, well, whatever you're doing, watching this video, <laughs> because I've never opened a boost box before. That was the first one I've ever opened, and it was really cool. I'd love to do it again at some point. Either way, Burning Shadows is a really cool set. We didn't get many Guzmas. We got two regular art Guzmas. Sorry if I was far away from my mic, then I'm picking up all this bulk, which I knocked over. Um, we got two regular Guzmas. Still pretty good. Two Guzmas from 
just random bulk is pretty good. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Look at the pack tower. And I will see you in the next video. I appreciate you sticking around. Bye, everybody. Thank you.